So Herman, tell me what happened to you today. Oh, well, we was having a church picnic today, and as soon as we were gathering, gathering for our congregation to, to have the, uh, the preaching, and uh, a tree fell down. We heard a snap, and the tree, we looked back, and the tree had fell over on our car. So a picture's worth a thousand words. Oh boy, so what was your reaction, and what was your reaction? Um, my reaction at first was in shock and just disbelief that this actually happened. Over, everybody was saying that the tree fell, and then I'm walking closer like, did it really hit the car, did it really hit the car? And the closer I get, I see it had hit the car. <laughs> so, you know, but that's life circumstances and situations happen, but the Lord is still on the throne. He, isn't, he has not forsaken me. He is still with me even in this, so I am faithful that this will be resolved and that all things happen for a reason. Yeah, Romans 8.28, all things work together for good to those that love God and are called according to His purposes. And, you know, this could have killed someone, and it didn't. It just dented your car a little. I'm writing a book called uh, Trampled to Death by Ducks, which is a strange title for a book. Trampled to death by an elephant would make sense. Okay, but to be trampled to death by ducks, there'd have to be a lot of ducks. They have to get you down and then suffocate you. And life is like that sometimes. There's just one thing after another. You get up and bang, down you go again. And, and the thing is to do what the Bible says and having done all to stand. And that's what you do because you know that everything comes by God's permissive will, not by his perfect will, but he lets some things happen because he knows it's gonna work out for our good. And good will come of this because God is good and kind and merciful and proved his love toward us by Christ dying on the cross. And that's our source of joy, isn't it? When we look to that cross, the love of God is so wonderfully displayed and death has lost its sting. Well, thank you so much for talking to me. Anything you'd like to say? Oh yeah, I was gonna say a lot of times, um, you know, we get comfortable as Christians. And if you're serving the Lord, the one thing, if you're uncomfortable, guess what, you gotta do stuff. So sometimes God makes things happen like this so that we won't be comfortable. We have to continue to pray. We have to, we always gotta continue to look out for the devil because he is warm like a roaring lion seeking whom he can devour. So uh, he's, if he's not messing with us, he's messing with someone else. So that's why we always should be in prayer and these kind of things remind us to be in prayer. And the safest place we can be is on our knees. Right, Amen. that's correct. That's yes. absolutely. Amen.